This looks really, really good and it tastes amazing! What's up? Welcome back to another weekly vlog. If you're new, my name is Akusia Benhini. If you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, hey boo, what it do? Okay, my intro. I know you guys like it. <laughs> I like it too. I like to be cheesy and playful, so I don't think I'm ever gonna stop doing an intro. Anyway, you're welcome to a new weekly vlog. It's Monday today. It's currently 2 p.m. I am about to do a few things. Um, when I say do a few things, cook. <laughs> I'm about to cook. I haven't cooked anything all day. We had some leftover jollof from yesterday, so that's what we had this morning. But I'm about to actually cook, cook something. And I'm going to be sharing my um, shrimp, pasta shrimp recipe with you guys. There's a lot of shrimp pasta recipe. I have like a lot different ones that I do, but I will share the most basic one because I love me a good pasta and I love shrimp. So a combination of those two is like fire. But anyway, you're welcome to another weekly vlog. I have two things from Amazon. So let's look at that. I have two things from Amazon. So let's take a look at that. Oh, okay. So this is a play pad for my oldest child. She is um she's almost six so i already got one of these for her and she's bought it so i got another one for her this stuff is really nice if you're a mom let me just put you on <laughs> this stuff is really nice actually so it's uh i don't want to take it out of the box just yet but basically what it does is it's like an ipad it's like an ipad right but it comes with cats so it comes with readable cats and when you what happens is that they're gonna insert the cards into the um, ipad and then the ipad is going to read what's off the card for you or just basically do the activity that the card is supposed to do it's really fun the first one that i go for it was kind of like the same thing but this one has a lot this is apparently bilingual 40 fun lessons 130 um 1300 plus sounds and melodies and then 70 plus games she would love this this is definitely different from the one that i got here the one that i got here was more more so like play toy <clears throat> this is really nice it's like a learning ipad so it's not just like an ipad it's an ipad that comes with activities and like readable cards and stuff it's really nice so maybe i'll just open and show you guys just in case any mom out here is like looking and maybe wants to check it out for their child oh this is actually really big this is nice so it's not an actual ipad again it's not an actual ipad what happens is it comes with these cards so you basically just insert one of the cards and then there's activity that you have to do so when you insert the cards it will turn on you know and then give you what you have to do so this is really fun activity after school activity and then i also what is this oh i know what this is oh this is exciting i can finally throw that one away <laughs> so i also got but it's so small <laughs> i got a can opener this is literally just a portable can opener that's why it's portable i don't even know why i didn't think of the fact that it was portable um but oopsie sorry i just put the trash on the floor and it made that sound <laughs> anyway so this is meant to open tin stuff so like yeah i have one the one that i have is actually like big you guys this one right here that one right next to the coffee situation that's that's one of those but it's old i actually thrifted that from um i think goodwill it's i've had it for five years thrifted and i've had it for five years like <laughs> it's insane so that that should show you how good that stuff is and it still works but it works a little slower now and sometimes it won't spin 
but it's very very effective it's like one of the best things i've had in the kitchen so far it makes my life so easy with like canned stuff and like just opening anything um but i needed i knew that i needed to get a new one because this will just die on me like five years what are you talking about so i did get a new one let me see i will figure out how to use it it's just a tin opener so if you have if you cook with like a lot of like tin stuff i do a lot of tin tomatoes and stuff like that and opening this stuff is annoying so this is what i use i'm gonna figure out how to use this one and then yeah but that's what it is that's the only two things that i have from amazon i literally just like styled my hair sort of like you know curled my hair um, but the last time that you guys saw, saw me in the last vlog, I took out my braids and I had put in some tape ins. It's been like that vlog was like two weeks ago or like three weeks ago, so it's been a while. <laughs> but um, I did some tape ins, I had that for like two weeks, and then I took that out yesterday. So I just washed my hair and then, like, you know, just styled it, made it look cute or whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna get into cooking. And just like make myself something and then we'll I'll show you guys my pasta shrimp pasta recipe and then that should be basically it for today because I don't think that I'm doing much today it's a holiday so there's not a lot going there's not like too much going on right now um, we're just chilling and I'm just like editing and you know doing the basic stuff that I do around the house so Let's get into cooking and let me show you guys how I make my pasta situation because I love it. I love it. <laughs> When they say she get it from her mama, mama say you fuck her right. Your body big is bumpin' like a dummy in the hall, but come tell me is you down? Cause I'm tryna go good tonight. I'm only hope she slept right. I just wanna live in a fantasy. I think we deserve it right. Top of the memory. So this is what it looks like this looks really really good and it tastes amazing i used maggi cube uh, okay i used the regular maggi cube literally the regular maggi cube and that's the only thing i used and it tastes great it tastes amazing i love this so much um i'm gonna pour myself some wine because why not you guys look at the wine my husband bought for me this is a whole gallon literally a whole jag of wine <laughs> so yeah that's what i've been drinking the name is called forti fortissimo it's really nice actually it's not like sweet it's in between sweet um and like dry so i kind of like it this is dinner y'all <laughs> this is literally dinner one last look before i go and devour this plate i'm gonna go eat enjoy this i hope that you're able to steal this recipe i'm not gonna lie it was so good it was so simple i didn't add anything you season it to your taste whatever season um seasoning you feel like works best for you use it 
but this recipe is hands down so juicy and so good you want to keep some of that pasta water for later so when you cook the pasta you're not throwing all of that water away because you're gonna go back and add some of that and then you want to use your heavy cream I love heavy cream it has so much flavor um, you can use sour cream if you wanted to and then add the pasta water to give you the juice that you're looking for so love it try it let me know if you like it and yeah you guys I'm gonna go enjoy my dinner and I'll see you later good morning guys good morning happy Tuesday I literally just finished working out but it's time for day can run so uh, it's 6.52 6.54 I'm making breakfast for my pa I just finished giving her bath you know all of that stuff I'm making breakfast for her and then Jackie should be here at around 7.20 and then we'll be gone so good morning happy Tuesday you're welcome to the Tuesday <laughs> hi hi friends good afternoon good evening that's the Ghana girl in me I'm always gonna say hi and greet you <laughs> anyway it's Tuesday oh you guys saw me in the morning right you saw me in the morning my camera disrespectfully went off my battery died apparently I hadn't charged all two batteries that I had so that was what happened in the morning but it was daycare run and now she's back from daycare Yes, my love. It's cold season. The mommy, mommy. <laughs> She's running now. Oh gosh, she knows what I'm about to do. I'm about to wipe her nose. It's the change of season is affecting her, so she has a cold. She still has a cold. I think I told you in last week's vlog. She still has a cold. Anyway, you guys. So we're back home from daycare. Miss Mama, say hi to the people. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> yes, that's so sweet of you. You said hi to the people. She said hi. She actually said hi. She usually never wants to say hi to anybody. <laughs> so, um, but you guys, it's that's what happened in the morning. I did the daycare run. I'm back home. Been back home. She's back home as well. It's 5 p.m. She doesn't like this biscuit. It's good. She came to put the biscuit down. <laughs> you don't like the biscuit, mama? You want your food? Okay, guys, I'm sorry about that. If you have a toddler, you know when they come back from school, they're literally so hungry. I don't know, and the sun is out, so today they went outside, they had like a little failed day situation. So she's hungry, so I'm just feeding her the food. Um, <clears throat> the food that she has, I don't know, I said feeding her the food, but anyway. I have myself some wine. I'm about to make dinner. It's 5.36. I am... Um, I'm about to make Indomie. I don't know why. I'm, one, I'm craving Indomie. Two, I'm feeling lazy. I said two whys. That's why I'm about to make Indomie. But that's not why I'm here. I'm here because I wanted to show you guys something. So, so this stuff right here. Let me give you some backstory before I show you what this is. I do have... Um, low iron i don't want to say i'm anemic because i'm not um, but i definitely have low iron in my system so it usually um comes to play when i'm pregnant or usually comes to play when i'm about to have a baby so i'm not pregnant right now if you're wondering <laughs> but i realized that even after like even after i had my kids i realized that um i still get dizzy sometimes i will still get tired i'm always complaining about being tired you guys know on here i'm always complaining about my joints aching and just generally always being tired um and apparently that had to do with the fact that i have like ion, ion deficiency i think that's what it's called so um in my mind i honestly in my mind i'm like it only really comes to play when I'm pregnant. Like it only really comes to play when I'm pregnant. I'm getting dizzy like crazy. I literally cannot feel myself sometimes. I would literally feel like I'm about to fall off. Like literally. It happens sometimes. And then when I'm not pregnant sometimes also it happens. You know when I'm not pregnant sometimes I would feel just very tired. Like I said just generally very tired. 
when I work out, I have all these pains. Sometimes it's almost impossible to even wake up to work out because I just don't feel like it. And you know, it's just that fatigue, that feeling of fatigue every time. And I know that because I know that mine is associated to the fact that I had that iron deficiency. And again, in my mind, I was like, uh -huh, it only comes into play when I'm pregnant. So there's no need for me to like take care of it or combat it. I'll just like take care of it with food not like not take care of it but i'll just take care of it with food is what i meant to say and then when i'm pregnant i take ion supplements because every pregnant woman every pregnant woman does that so now <laughs> and it's all over the place forgive me guys but i'm getting there i'm getting there so ouch 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 so when um someone like last year like last year two years ago i think two years ago was when i went to see the doctor about my hair and like alopecia i did a full um scalp scan to see what was going on with my hair and why my hair wasn't growing and then i found out that it was alopecia another thing that came to play was iron is low in my system so that could also be part of the reasons why so when i came back from that checkup that like hair scan from seeing that hair doctor i actually got some iron supplements i think i got some i um iron tablet off of like amazon or walgreens or something like that but then for whatever reason i went back to do some more research and some people were saying that that particular one was too strong or if you don't have like a crazy deficiency you want to be careful what type of iron supplements you're taking and also um you know if you want like healthy hair if you want to feel a lot less like fatigued and stuff like that then you need to up your iron so then in my mind i'm like i know for a fact that i have to do something about my iron because i work out i eat healthy you know i try to eat healthy but i take off myself in general like i'm very conscious of myself as a person but i think the one thing that was lacking was the iron because like i don't know why i'm always tired i don't know why i'm always like pressed and like I feel like I'm never finishing the things around me. I feel like it definitely has to do with iron. And another thing is, there's this YouTube girlie that I follow. You love Megs. If you know her, if you feel like an OG person on YouTube, you've been watching YouTubers for a while, you probably will know her. Um, I think her name, what she says is Mean Megs. I think so. Um, but I've been following her for a while. She's a relaxed girlie. I've been following her for a while. Even when I wasn't relaxed, I was still following because I just like her vibe. And she had just posted a video talking about how like thin her hair is and like things that she was doing to help with her hair thinning and everything. And then the subject of iron came up. Iron deficiency came up. And the way she explained it and everything, it just made so much sense because Aside the fact that iron is affecting like my daily lifestyle and everything, it's probably part of the reasons why my hair is so thin. Because you guys, aside the fact that I have alopecia, my hair in general, it's so thin. It's so like fizzy, dry, thin, all of that like stuff. My hair naturally in the front is like kind of heavy. You can obviously see that. It definitely has a lot more volume in the front and then in the back it's like super thin, super light. When I put on it, a, a, like when I do a ponytail, it looks like I'm like literally a ball. My head is like a ball. <laughs> it looks like, oh, my head looks bald. That's the word. And also another thing that the doctor said was, if I wanted my edges to grow out, I had to leave my hair out. I think I've said this so many times. He said that braids, like protective style, all of that stuff, they don't help your hair grow. They protect the hair in between, like you know like harsh weathers and stuff like that but they really don't like do much for you especially in the nape area here and for me my scalp is very soft my hair is very soft so she he, he mentioned that i want to be gentle i want to do everything that's like kind loving to my hair so at this point i'm gonna be wearing my hair out a lot more i just decided that this year i want to wear my hair out a lot so not even just this year like just generally moving forward i love wearing my hair out it's like my vibe it's truly truly my vibe that's why you guys see me touching my hair a lot and like always trying to change my hairstyles and whatnot that's just because i love my hair i don't care like if my hair is broken or not like i love wearing my hair out so i have dedicated myself to like do things that will help my hair grow and be healthy even if my edges are not growing because at this point i don't know if my edges will grow i really don't Ooh. but even if my edges are not growing 
crazy i do still want my hair to be healthy and like nice and full you know all of that so she had mentioned something about geritol this stuff right here it's an ion supplement um liquid situation it's just it's medicine but it's iron <laughs> it's an iron supplement and it's an iron supplement and that's what she had been taking for at this point for like a year and a half now or for like no she said eight months she said eight months she said at this point she's been taking it for eight months and she can swear by the fact that this has changed a lot in her general well-being and then her hair health as well so that really made me excited because again i've been thinking of ion for a while and the fact that it could possibly help my hair grow and make me feel a lot less fatigued i am up for it like i need it okay so so i decided to get <laughs> i almost dropped it but i decided to get the same thing that she had she said it was very tall i read a few reviews you guys know i'm the queen of reviews so i'm gonna read that reviews to my research i did that and everybody says it doesn't taste nice but it does the job so i like that from i mean i don't like medicine i'm not gonna lie it's not really my vibe okay <laughs> but this is what it looks like it's literally iron supplement i'm gonna be taking this this is meant to expire in 2025 so still definitely good i got this from walgreen so i'm not even impressed about you know if it could possibly be bad or good but yeah i'm just gonna be trying this out for the next few months i will stay with this add it to my list of supplements that i'm taking oh i do have another supplement that i'm taking with my rituals from zen wise i don't know if you guys have heard about them but these these are probiotics fast acting probiotics if you go on amazon i will leave a link on my amazon store phone because it's actually very good okay like very good i saw it on one girl's page on instagram she was randomly talking about the things she swears by and you know and i've been following her for a while i think she's beautiful so i went to check them out i read the reviews and then i tried it out this is i feel like i'm almost like a month in taking these and they act fast they don't even like when they say fast acting because it really does act fast it cleared my guts like I could literally quite literally tell that this was making some changes in my gut area and I love that for myself I'm all about health this year like I'm literally taking charge of my health gut health hair health general health like I am here for it I feel like I'm at that age right now where I'm very particular about my health and just generally being invested in my health so I have that as well I will put you guys on I'll let you guys know any um, updates in the future that I have on this but for right now I think it's beautiful I love this stuff and how it makes me feel no reactions whatsoever so love it so I have my supplements sitting right there <laughs> I have my creatine my protein powder my prebiotics and probiotics I have my iron oh I love that myself I sound so grown I sound like a grown woman who's taking care of her health but y'all i'm almost 30 like who am i kidding i am a big girl like i should get that in my head i should stop feeling like i'm little because i still be feeling like i'm a baby like i literally still sometimes feel like i'm a child i'm not a bit kidding but i'm almost 30 so i have to clock that i have to clock that into my brain you are almost 30 you are someone's mom so get that here <laughs> anyway let's cook let's make some indomie I don't know if I'm gonna be cooking with you. I don't think so, but I will show you when I'm done. <laughs> Cause Indomie is basic. You guys already know Indomie. I will make it nice and fancy though. So I will show you when I'm done. Okay, I will show you when I'm done. Hey guys, so this is dinner. Indomie is ready. This is for hubby and myself. We're eating together. So yeah, it tastes really good, by the way. <laughs> I have just finished doing my nighttime routine and all of that. But I just wanna say that this portion of the vlog is sponsored by Dematica. If you don't know what Dematica is, or if you're hearing about Dematica for the very first time, 
this is the products okay so dermatica is a prescription based skincare brand basically what they do is based on your skin type and your skin concerns they go ahead and prescribe um a formula for you something that is going to cater to whatever you're dealing with in terms of skincare so in my case i have my concentration in this little jar right here my situation is textured skin i do have quite you know i have some textures here and there my skin generally is nice and smooth and beautiful i really don't have any concerns like that but textures it doesn't entirely make my makeup look smooth you know so i opted into dermatica because i wanted my textures to go away have they gone away have i seen any difference in textures beautiful difference okay that's an exaggeration, like the way I said beautiful difference. But I have seen great difference in my skin. Because of this one product right here, I don't have to do too much with my skincare at this point. I just have to use two, three products and I'm good to go. Because this thing right here, she gets the job done. And I love it for myself. So usually what I do is I, you know, wash my face, cleanse do that whole stuff and then I come and apply a toner. You want to apply any toner of your choice just to bring that balance into your skin because usually after you wash your skin, you know, it gets dry. You need to bring balance before you go ahead and add a serum or treatment onto your skin. So that's what I do. I do my toner, my eye cream, just so that I have, you know, these areas protected and then I'm going to go ahead and apply this right here. This again is my formula. If you do try out Dermatica, your formula might be different. The ingredients that you have in your formula will entirely be different because again, it's prescription based. So it's based on your skin and it's personalized for you. Okay, so I love this stuff. I cannot stop talking about it. It's helped me so much with my skincare and it's brought my skin, like skincare game from like here to here with little to no products. I'm not even kidding. I've only had to use this and I love that. So, so all you need is literally two pumps, just like that. And I like to put that across all areas of my skin. And that is literally it, you guys. I can decide to want to top this up with a moisturizer or you can just leave it by itself. This by itself is a moisturizer so it gets the job done with or without a moisturizer. It's a moisturizing serum. So it is right there. Like it's perfect for my girls who don't like to do extra with their skincare or who basically don't have time. Like we don't have time. If you have a nine to five job and you come home and you're cooking, taking care of the kids, taking care of heavy and then at the end of the day you have like just literally no time to do skincare this is exactly what you need because it's going to get your skin looking right without you having to do too much so that is literally it for my nighttime skincare it's like three products and i'm done i am done and i'm here for it it's cut everything down but my skin still looks beautiful and healthy and my make my makeup is still sitting right and everything so i love dermatica i can't stop talking about it and raving about it because it's really that good um and when it comes to skincare i'm very particular with what i recommend to my followers because i'm like no <laughs> Like, I need to know how it works. Skincare for me, I'm very particular. If I accept a lot of products from brands, that's because I know that these products are going to work for me. If it doesn't work for me, I'm not gonna talk about it. So, I have tried this, tested, proved, loved, like I cannot say the words, but this stuff is beautiful and I love it. I will go ahead and leave a link. I do have a discount code that allows you to get 10% off your purchase with the Matica site wide. So whatever you're checking out on your site, you can still get 10% off, but try it out. Try it out. Don't say I didn't tell you. Don't say I didn't tell you, okay? I have my link right here. I mean, my um, discount code right on the screen. So go ahead and use that. I'll also leave it in the description box for the girls who want to check it out later. Be sure to tell a sister about it. Because if the skincare is good, why keep it to yourself? Like, why are you keeping it to yourself? You gotta sh tell someone. Share it with a friend, okay? Share it with a friend. I like that for you. Okay, so you guys, that's it for my nighttime routine. I put some oils and stuff in my hair. Not too much, nothing crazy. Um, but I'm just going to wrap this up and go to bed. I'm literally just going to put a scarf over this and go to bed. Legit. 
it's quite early it's 8 34 <laughs> can you guys imagine like we're done with everything i cooked early today i cleaned up the kitchen took a shower from a pet showered my husband is literally dozing off so we are ready to go to bed so i'm gonna go to bed and then i think i'll see you guys tomorrow i really love how short my hair is it's like literally non-existent i am such a short hair girl <laughs> like it gives me life i'm not even gonna lie but anyway Good night guys, I will see you guys tomorrow morning. For people how are you <laughs> yes ma say good morning to the people good morning people happy wednesday is it wednesday today it's wednesday because thursday should have been going to the kiss so it's wednesday that's how bad my day count is ah. <laughs> anyway this is how my hair looks like right now <laughs> when it's not like styled or like curled when it's not curled curled what this is what my hair looks like when it's not styled if i don't have like if i don't put any iron in my hair this is what it currently looks like right now because i cut it i've cut it a long time like what am i saying goodness akusia i can't even find my words this morning i have cut my hair <laughs> i have cut a lot of it off it used to be the bangs used to be like really long but now the bangs are short because i honestly wanted to go very short i think i told you guys this yesterday but that's what my hair looks like right now <laughs> anyway so i am about to take my iron supplement i am dreading myself because a lot of the reviews said it wasn't nice so i know that this is not going to taste nice um but i have to take it i have to put on my big girl pants and take this medicine so i am going to take it i just finished eating breakfast it's 10 a.m it's like 9 58 so it's like two minutes to 10 my husband and I, we had breakfast. I made some tea, some bread, and some eggs. I know it's not gonna be nice, but I gotta be an adult and take this. So, <gasps> ah! I hate taking medicine. Like, I just hate taking medicine. Anything that's like liquid medicine, I'm, I don't like it. I, I'm okay with tablets. God. Oh, one tablespoon daily after meals. <gasps> Oh, I feel like I know it's not gonna be nice, but okay, let's do this. I don't have an option. Let us do this. Yeah, 15 ml daily. So it comes with a measuring cup. I'm just gonna use that. Yikes. Yeah. <laughs> Americans are exaggerators at the biggest core. Like, what? 
it is literally nothing as compared to what we take or what we've taken back home as kids the paracetamol syrups and you know that this is nothing as compared to that this is literally like cough syrup this is like orange juice but medicine like it tastes like medicine orange juice like this is literally not bad i don't know why they made me feel like it was going to be bad it's not i can't even taste it oh you guys are pumped <laughs> everybody that tastes this and says that I, I mean like anybody that said that this wasn't nice they're just pumped you guys are just freaking pumped children like what okay i took it down it's all gone i'm happy because it's not bad so i won't dread taking it every day it doesn't taste bad so yeah wow <laughs> so today the agenda that we have for today is i have a meeting we have a meeting um for from Appa. i don't know if i mentioned to you guys but if i is currently in le intervention if you didn't know what le intervention is it's just basically the kids that have de development delays like kids that are, you guys know she hasn't started talking fully talking yet she would literally just blab a few words here and there like ba 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 stuff like that like when she's hungry she would say d d d stuff like that so she hasn't fully spoken any words um so we I, I, you guys know if you've been watching my vlogs you already know the backstory so the next step for us has been early intervention um so they come home to do assessments with her they've been here twice we have another one coming on today today's own i don't think it's a crazy assessment because the last time i had four whole women in my house four whole old women in my house i wanted to i don't want to invade their privacy even though i have videos i recorded everything but i don't want to post it on youtube because you know like it's some someone's moms and they're doing their business but i recorded it for myself and then hopefully in the future i can show it to my daughter and let her know that this is the journey she's been through you know i feel like it'll be beautiful because i believe strongly that she is going to you know get to that stage where we need her to get to she is going to talk she's going to do everything that a child needs to do to survive in this world because this world is crazy and i just want the best for her so um i recorded that just for memories for us the family so this is nothing like I want to edit and put it out here now. I'm just letting you guys know that. But that's what we've been doing. So they did that and then they're coming back. Just one person is coming back today to do another one because, again, she's turning three very soon. And when she turns three, she has to, they have to transition her from the daycare school system to the preschool system. So this country is very different. America is very different. Everything is like system systems paperwork paperwork <laughs> and it's like a lot of like research and asking questions and making sure that you're on the right path because if you don't ask the right questions you're just you know because you're from another country i wasn't born in this country so i have to do the research we have to do the research my husband and i to make sure that we have the correct information so this lady is going to come here and help us with the preschool transitioning system um, but my thing is when she's three I don't want her to leave the daycare just yet because she literally started daycare this year No, this particular daycare this year. She's been to a few daycares like two But this particular one she only started this year and she seems happy She seems to be cool with the kids and the daycare itself is really nice. The kids are not a lot It's like just when she started it was like just six kids and then now it's like eight kids i think the the more the daycare grows the more they give them the chance to add more kids so she likes it there she's calm the pictures and everything she the the teacher is good and everything you know so i love it there for her so i kind of want her to stay at that daycare for this whole year so that we figure out what's happening um, but i wanted to finish this daycare so that maybe next year I feel like next year the changes will happen i believe strongly the next year we can think of maybe moving her to preschool but i feel like preschool right now is too much for her so um yeah well, I'll, I'll let you guys know how that goes eventually what might happen is she'll go to daycare for three days and then preschool for two days because she, either way she still has to go to the preschool um she, it's not like by force because i can decide to not let her go to school <laughs> but we do want her to go to school so um yeah <clears throat> that's what is happening so we're waiting for her she should be here at 12 and um, but in the meantime 
I am going to be editing. I do want to do my hair. I want to braid my hair, not like style my actual hair. I have been wanting to braid my hair for a while. I wanted to wait towards the end of the month so that it will be like a fresh month, fresh braid. But I also really want to like get my hair away from my face right now because I'm I just want to braid my hair. I just want to do something, take my hair away. And I'm not really in the mood for wigs right now because I'm letting my hair rest and just my edges i don't want to touch my edges like glue and stuff i'm letting it rest like letting my edges rest from the glue so um with that being said i'm thinking of doing the braids right now because i edited some content yesterday which i can post today so i don't really have to edit but because i'm not working that's all i do anyway so um i might braid my hair i just might braid my hair while I wait for the lady to come, my hair is not a lot, so I don't think I will take a lot of time braiding my hair. I'm thinking some French curl braids, um, but whatever I decide to do, I will show you guys. But that's just the plan for the day. I don't really have any serious plan, just early development assessment and then edit some content, do my hair, and then call it a day, literally. So if anything else comes up, I will surely let you know. But as of right now, I'm gonna go figure out what I wanna do if I wanna do my hair right now or just chill and braid my I mean, like edit some content. Um, but good morning, happy Wednesday. I will see you guys later in the day, okay? Hey guys. Happy Thursday. It is Thursday today because tomorrow is Friday. Hi guys, um, happy Thursday. Let me grab some water. I just finished creating some content and I'm about to unbox a few things that I have from Amazon. So let's get into that. Let's see what we have. Um, but also I look pretty, so acknowledged. <laughs> I, I hate my phone when I do that. I'm like... I, but I'm literally the queen. I'm literally the queen of gassing myself up. Like, I'm always gassing myself up. Because if I don't hear from my husband, I'm hearing it from me. And that's it. Like, uh, and maybe you guys, and that's it. So, you guys already know that my life is boring. At this point, we already know. It's an established fact. <laughs> but let's see what we have from Amazon. I have a few things from Amazon. And I hope... Because, yeah. Calm down. Okay? And talk. Like a normal person. <laughs> I have a few things from Amazon and I also have some PR so let's go ahead and see what we have in everything okay so the first thing that I have here this is a really cute beach bag you guys know it's summer and the girls are gonna be going out not me <laughs> I'm kidding I am gonna be going out a little I think um, I'm I wanted to wait and tell you guys but at this point i think i won't go so let me just tell you um i was meant to be going on a trip for my birthday with my friends um not like my friends my friends my best friend <laughs> my best friend friends my best friend's friends so my best friend and i my best friend in new york you guys already know kofi we celebrate our birthday literally at the same time he's the 10th of june and i'm the 11th of june so since time immemorial we've always celebrated our birthdays together um up until we moved to the u.s and he lived in new york and i lived here and you know the story was a different story and adulting happened we haven't had time so this year he's turning 30 and he is doing a group trip to mexico and eventually my birthday is right after his birthday so i figured i would go to mexico with him I mean with his group of friends and then celebrate my birthday in mexico i mean eventually that was what i was supposed to do but <laughs> in other news i got a new job okay you guys it's good news it's exciting news i'm very grateful but i got a new job i'm starting a new job on monday literally for four or three days from today i'm starting a new job with a new company very grateful for this new opportunity but with that being said, I don't know if I can go to Mexico now that I'm starting a new job. So, I don't know. But I have been shopping for Mexico. I'm not going to lie. I have shopped. I've been shopping since like last December. <laughs> like literally, I've been shopping so much. 
um, I have a lot of things so I got this bag that's why I got this bag I felt like this would be like a really cute this is how you hold it actually so you can decide to like hold it like that but this is not cute right so you can also hold it like this like a little clutch situation and then the bow is right there like it's really cute I love it when you pack it up I feel like it will look really cute but if you guys are gonna go on vacation I can leave a link for you um because this is really beautiful like this is entirely too cute I love it and I keep shopping because in my mind I keep being the Lulu and keep feeling like I could maybe go you know because I just need like two days off because we're going over the weekend and Monday Tuesday I'm gonna be back on Wednesday so I don't know we'll see we'll see I didn't wanna I wanted to surprise you guys but now that I've told you if I happen to go to Mexico it means I will go to Mexico in June if I don't I'll find another time to go to Mexico because whatever <laughs> oh the next thing that I have here is a watch and this is very exciting because I recently also got a new watch um, I feel like I'm I feel like I needed to I'm sorry people are closed from work so it's quite noisy in the area um, but I feel like I've, I'm getting to the stage or the age where I just want to collect like beautiful um, you know woman woman like stuff if it makes sense <laughs> like having a watch I feel like that's a grown girl situation right like and not let me show you the other one that I have you guys will understand what I'm saying so this is the watch that I got isn't this so grown like isn't this such a grown girl watch like this is perfect I love it I love this watch so much it's such a basic watch but it's like very much I'm a grown girl I have a watch <laughs> And then this one is a bracelet watch, also from Amazon, as always, because I work with them. So everything that I show you on here is usually from Amazon. If it's not, I will let you know. Um, but this is a bracelet watch. This is how it looks like. Literally, just a watch, but bracelet. I see a little part. I don't know if it's broken, because that will hurt my soul. Because this is such a gorgeous piece of watch. Oh, I don't think it's broken. I think you can attach it. Okay, you guys. So this is what it looks like when I put it on. It's really beautiful, right? And it's a bracelet, so I have to reduce it. I think I'm going to take the second pass that I just put on. I will take it off. And that's what it looks like. That's basically what it looks like. It's just a simple bracelet watch that you can dress up with. So I love it. I am in love with it and then I got a set of tops these are just like basic round necks I got these because I'm starting work on Monday just basic tops this is actually really cute I'm about to wear it and run right now like and it comes in three colors And the quality is, it's not like a regular t-shirt, it's like stretchy. So, I like that. Okay, so, the last thing I have is a brand that I'm meant to be working with. The name is Demiki. Let me show you what we have in here. And let me just show you guys my earrings because I feel like this is really pretty. And I'm also going to take it off like right now. Because it's kind of heavy. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie about that it is kind of heavy um, but this is what they look like this is really pretty very much statement piece of earring I like that. so this is the brand name Demiki so it's a k-beauty brand um, they basically do oriental botanical fragrance hair and body care products basically so it's not like I know what's the you know the thing situation but I'm going to be working with them. So thank you so much, Demiki, for sponsoring this part of the vlog. Let me give you guys some information. So again, they have body washes. They have body shower, um, body shower oils. They have lip serums. They have hair products. They have face masks. They have essence oils. They have body lotions. Just generally body products and hair products. So that's what they have. And they're a K-beauty brand. Um, I do have a discount code with them, so I will definitely share that with you guys. First thing I have here is the Demiki Body Treatment Oil. 
this has sakura aroma this is what it looks like this is really gorgeous and it has the basic stuff it has sunflower seed oil coconut oil corn oil i haven't really used anything with corn oil that's interesting and you can apply this all over your skin so I do want to take a photo for them for my Instagram so that's why I'm not like opening the package but eventually we'll use these together you guys already know I'm always screaming if a product is good like I would make noise so if it's if you don't hear about them again just know just know okay just know <laughs> okay so the next thing that I have here is their body shower oil this is a pretty good size it's a 300 ml so you know that this is gonna last you a good amount of time plus this is definitely going to be very moisturizing i love me a good body shower oil it just leaves you glistening and like oh god i can't wait to use this this is, this is definitely they they know the business okay they know the things i like and they sent them my way because they didn't send hair products and i love that because i ain't got the hair for it like Let's be honest, I don't have the hair for it, so I do have the skin for it. I'm ready to use this, so why? <laughs> and then the next thing, or the last thing that I have is the actual body wash. So this is just a body wash. I'm excited. Let me open one. Just one. Oh, this is such a simple packaging. Can you imagine? That is their body wash. Like... The packaging is so simple and straight to the point. They don't have time. But this is a very simple body wash. This is definitely also travel friendly, if if, if I do say so myself. I think you could travel with this. Hmm, that's nice. This is their body shower oil. And for, for, whatever, weird, for whatever weird reason, their bottle is plastic, right? But it feels like glass, like it's like very good quality plastic. And it's so well packaged, like I really like this, it's so simple. Oh, I'm gonna go arrange this in the bathroom, it's like my little self-care situation, I like it. Ah, look at this, like look at this packaging. Isn't this too cute, like, is it just me? Oh, this is cute, because this is entirely beautiful. This is really beautiful. And this is actually glass unlike the applicator as well it's so simple oh I love this I do I really do so put together Daniki <laughs> that is really gorgeous um, but you guys that is everything that I have in this today's deliveries <laughs> if I do get a lot more deliveries in the future definitely um, but I'm definitely loving the watch I'm not gonna lie and also again I have a 10% discount code so not just a discount code that discount code allows you to get 10% off the Miki product so if you do want to wait for me to actually try the product and give you a good review before you go and check them out that's good if you also just wanted to check them out because you know that K Beauty products are top notch and they're good, then you can do that. Okay, I will leave a link in the description box so you can check them out. Um, but right now it's time for me to go and pick up my little girl. It's three twenty. Um, I have to go and pick it up. So I'm gonna go do that, and then when I come back home, we'll catch up again. If you don't see me again today, just know that I will see you tomorrow. But I will see you again today. I'm sure. I'm sure of that. Let me just go and pick up my little girl, and then when I come back. We will catch up, okay? What's this? That's fine for you I knew that we would jump to good night Just to five you I swear I lied to that bitch I do it All of them all wrong You scared to do I'm not Long as you joking Now it's the me I got it I've been scheming Do it Hide your body As long as you dreaming about me Ain't no problem I don't got nobody Just me you right now Tell the truth I look better under you I can lose When I'm with you How can I lose And miss the moment You just too it Nobody in the body like you do I can't lose when I'm with you I can't just lose and miss the moment You just too important Ain't nobody in the body like you do yeah. In the drop top right with you I feel like Scarface That white bitch with the
the bob, I'll be your main one Take this argument back up to my place Sex from all you, I'm not violent on your day one We had to, yeah, we smashed it, yeah Smash and grab shit, yeah Last grab is taking hold when you're not here 